one of the registered dietitians here at Conway Medical Center. And in celebration of two of our newest volunteers, we're making some doggy treats. Who are our volunteers, do you ask? Well, we have Mr. McDuffie and Ellie May. They're our canine volunteers, and we've invited them to come to the hospital to go to the different units and bring some cheer and happiness to all of our employees throughout the hospital. So, we are making some pumpkin peanut butter doggy treats. I mean, this is something I guess you could eat as a human too because it's all natural, but it's made specifically for dogs. So we started with about three cups of rolled oats. We're gonna add a cup of pumpkin puree. Pumpkin is a great treat for dogs, especially if they're not feeling so well. Pumpkin is really good for dogs' tummies. And we have some peanut butter, because I haven't met a dog that doesn't love peanut butter. That's about a half a cup, quarter cup to half a cup. And we just use a little bit of milk, about a quarter cup of milk, to blend everything together. And we're gonna just give this a little bit of a stir. We're so lucky to have these trained, certified dogs to be joining us in the hospital. It brings a few minutes of cheer to our day. It's been a difficult few years for anyone that's been working in healthcare and everywhere, really. So it is nice to have that little added sunshine in our days with our, pup, our puppies that are joining us throughout the hospital. So once this is all mixed up, you can just take scoops of it and roll it into balls. Depending on the size of your dog, if you have a smaller dog, you might want smaller balls. If you have a bigger one, you can make bigger treats for them. And this is just a quick little treat for your doggies to enjoy. Maybe it's for their birthday. I always make a doggy cake for my dog for their birthday. But for any time too, it's a nice healthy doggy treat.